Alright, so I think this is just the nature for this game. Department of Ancient History, Log Entry 238. I have devoted years of my life to the search for an ancient occult formula intended to reverse the flow of time. I am trying to decipher the writings of long-forgotten scribes, and I believe I have made a significant find in one of the old alchemical notes we found on Vernum, an island off the coast of Norway. I have brought all the material I have gathered to my home in order to study it without any distractions. The books speak of a spiritual presence, a thing of darkness which stalks unhindered across all dimensions. It is said to be all-seeing and all-knowing. I can feel my mind losing its grasp on reality as I dig deeper and deeper into this madness. Reading aloud exacerbates the process, but also I sense a force taking hold of my mind. Yet it is by such thorough disquisition upon the contents of these books that I believe I have found a solution to my wife's affliction. And yet, now I begin to fear that it is far too late. Signed, Professor Theodore Westmark. Somebody's knocking. and patent for here shall they oh didn't read it all okay Westmark Manor what's going on YouTube so this is a mystery game horror slash adventure and you as you can tell from the intro you're basically trying to solve some mysteries and uncover some sort of formula ancient formula all right so I think this whole game takes place in just one manner I think I'm not positive um, this game just came out, so I don't know much about it yet. Okay, so let's check it out. How do you view exploration? Um, don't know. How do you view obstacles? More sanity? Less sanity? I think more sanity is probably a little better, right? Is free will real or just an illusion? Uh, I don't want any less of that. It's all in our minds. Are you a careless person? I'm just gonna say don't know. Is time relevant for pleasure? Slow is better. Quick is fun. Let's do slow is better. My destiny has been set. I was just trying to make it a little easy on me so I don't die all the time. There'll be a lot of ed uh, video editing. Is this the one we just saw? No, it's a different one. Oh, okay, so I found the mask. I put the mask on. This is where I'm at, I believe. get here okay so he's gonna talk half of the time <laughs> all right 
What an odd place. And it's dark. I need to find light somewhere. Okay. Whoa. Where in the world am I? Uh -huh. My notebook. Okay, so I grabbed it. Notebook. This is my dear old notebook. My best friend in need when memory fails me. All notes collected will be saved here. Inventory is Y. Uh, notebook is X. Get to the map. Mat is select. Uh, swap between this and the menu by pressing LBRB. Okay, great. Like pretty easy controls. So here's the map. Uh, it already tells me things I can interact with, I think. First floor, second floor, attic, basement. Okay, big place. Get it. Waking up in a place other than my bed was disconcerting. The noisome dark air filled me with dread. It is no mere darkness I see before me, I whispered to myself, but death itself. Ooh. Darkness note. I'd rather avoid this, the deep unknown darkness if possible. My condition makes me stiff in fear if I subject myself for too long. I will need a light source to see what I'm doing in the room. Darkness can also be very scary in some places. And having a lantern helps. Okay, that makes sense. He's afraid of dark. Find a lantern with oil or turn on lights with matches in some rooms in order to fight the dark ones. And to be able to find what you're looking for. Using matches on certain light sources can also help to find useful things in the rooms. Got it. Okay, search this table. Uh, match. What is that? I have no idea what that is. Okay, I don't know what this picked up. Sanity. This symbol represents your sanity. Your sanity is what keeps you going and keeps you alive. And once you, the sanity bar is empty, you will be lost in the darkness and will have to load your last save or spend sanity points to revive you in that same room. You have sanity points now and these are used towards things that have a sanity cost, like saving at podiums. Spend this, spend this points wisely. So podiums, I don't know, if pronouncing right. It's like a little stand, I think. Okay, so I got match. He's afraid of dark. It's dark in here. Uh, the dark makes it hard to see. I need some sort of light source. Okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa! What is this? There's some candles. Awesome. Chest. Let's check that out. Strange. It looks like some sort of seal is missing from the locking mechanism. In order to combine items, open your inventory and select an item and pick combine, then pick the item you want to combine. Okay. Uh, inventory. Okay, maybe I can combine these two. Looks like they go together. Looks like this little guy goes inside this big circle. Bang. Okay, how do I use it now? There we go. Uh huh. First puzzle solved. Activate deactivate lander by pressing F. Light reveals hidden things in the dark and protects you. Light sources like the lantern help you traverse the space where darkness is affecting you. Lanterns can be turned on and off by pressing RT and assigned the assigned key. Okay, got it. They run on lamp oil, so always having lamp oil is in inventory is a good to have if you want to travel through dark corridors. Got it. What else we got? <coughs> Wait, I thought that well, if I look at the map, I can interact with something here. Why is it not late me right now? Maybe I can't see it. Oh, there we go. A small creature lies on the table. It looks like it's been dissected. It's disgusting. Better not touch it. 
but next to it looks like you received identified. Okay, my, I don't want to use my, all my light. Okay, so identification kit and I have identified wine bottle. Uh, wait a minute. How, where, where did I get the door handle? Okay. Identify this guy. Potion. Marky bottle, unknown content. I don't know what that, that is for. So we're not gonna use it yet. Okay. So, Sanity Max, I got extra two, and Darkness Sensitivity, I got negative ten. Maybe this is, had to do something with setting like difficulty level at the very beginning. Uh, then it says you need nine sigils to unlock the gate. Whatever. What gate? Okay, let's go straight. That's strange. The door is missing a handle. Well, da da da, I got one. The crimson door creates an uneasy feeling. It seems if I have no other way to go. Hello? Anyone there? That's a monster lock in the world. Oh, that's not good. I'm under time too. Clock is ticking. Oh, bollocks. Billowing wisps of damp air filled my lungs as I took in the familiar yet haunting atmosphere. I thought to myself that this may look and feel like fragments of the Westmark estate, but it is not. Alright. Save your current progress. This will cost you one insanity point. No. I don't want to save yet, just started the game. That's weird. How did I end up here? You received leather. <clears throat> Interesting. Alright. So what is this guy's here? Oh, that's probably stairs, right? And there's another another object that I can interact with. So let's check that out first. Is that blood? Pocket watch. Interesting. My father's pocket watch. Been looking everywhere for this one. It's not ticking or missing and missing hands. Better keep it so I don't lose it again. My father's grand clock has been with us for ages. It seems to be stuck at 145. 145, that might be important. It's 
dark in here. Boom. Whoa. Did you really box? Land match. Okay. Why are you freaking out, dude? There's another door. Yeah, that's good. That's more light for me. What we got? So we got... Nailed shut. We'll need something in order to get through. Okay. Uh, don't have anything right now. Unless I can light it on fire. Oh. No. <laughs> that's not working. Okay. Leather. A large piece of leather. I wonder what that's used for. Okay. Jesus, who's knocking? Is it this door? It's a garden door. Ooh. The door is to the inner garden locked for some reason. Okay. Ah. Jesus. Oh yeah, candle. Let's light it up. So what did I just pick up? Theodore Westmark? Elizabeth never liked this painting. Despite seeing despite seeing despite seeing um Alchemy Bodies trying to find the Philosopher's Stone. Okay, what else is here? This looks strange. Um My light source is going down. Yeah, it is going down. Uh, sm smudge and dusty mirror with a faint reflection starting to uh, clean up the surface. Yes. Mm -hmm. Just my face. Nothing to distribute about that unless you ask anyone else but me. Nope. It's dark in here. Uh, I think I will need an axe to get through this one. Okay, I'm looking for an axe. A small clock, it will stop at 9.20. Dark in here. Okay, so that clock is stopped at 9.20 and the first clock, clock stopped at 1.45. So I think that might be something later for a puzzle, I don't know. From my experience with games, that time did matter in some of the games. I think Fear of the Dark Unknown was one of them. Might be Son of Horror too. this skeleton key part with Roman 5 interesting okay oh there's a light in here I like that what is this? Footprints hatch. Interesting. A hatch, at least to the other places, like shortcut, but fumbling in the dark is pointless. I need to find the others before I can go anywhere. You are here. First floor. Okay. There's another door. Oh. 
coming. Any candles that can light up? Yes. No matches. <laughs> Not good. That seems to be all important. But this looks strange. <sighs> Darkness makes it hard for to see any good things in it. Yuck. I lost some sanity points again. up in this game a little bit. Identified book. A place for gentlemen. The smell of cigar smoke and cognac soaked into the walls. Here is where the important discussions took place and decisions were made. How I used to wish to be a fly on these walls back then. You're better than this, son. You need to put in more effort. Whatever I do, it'll never be enough for you, father. Perhaps if you've stopped fooling around with school assignments, you'll be prepared for what's to come. I'm only trying to help you reach the goal we have set ahead. But father, I'm already an A-grade student, isn't that enough? Why do you pressure me to take on more than needed? When I am gone, the time will come for you to shoulder our family legacy. To face the struggle the Westmarks have fought for ages. I will not discuss this further right now, but trust me, it's for your own good. Oh, I don't have a match now. Okay, let's see some of the things we just picked up. Herbs. And identified uh, object. And I think, don't we have... Yeah, identification kit. We got four of them. Okay, this is a clue. A thick lump of my old journal notes. A thick lump. Uh oh, I just used it somehow. Oh, it's updated my journal. Okay. Okay, so I think I got this three pages, maybe this two. Okay, Theodore Journal, page one, the origins. Anglo-Saxon occult religion stemming as far back as the ancient Egyptian god Cook, also spelled as Kek or Keku. Kek, maybe it's Kek. It's basically the ancient Egyptian uh, deity of darkness. As a concept, the male form was seen as a frog or as a frog-headed man. The female form was seen as snake or snake-headed woman. He also symbolizes the unknown and chaos. The Anglo-Saxon version known as Nephology believed that darkness had powers unchallenged by other cults or beliefs. Nephology is based on an old notion that there are be beings here older than the world itself, from the nothing, the perpetual endless darkness, cometh everything, unknown source. Nephology. It is based on the belief that the darkness holds secrets unknown to man. It is thought that we are observed by an ancient once and protected by them if sworn total devotion. The ancient ones communicate through the dark, and a melding of the dark was ritualistic ceremony done in each eclipse. It is said that healing powers were granted by isolating yourself in total darkness for six days, with the risk of going insane from isolation and starvation. Those who made it through were crowned as touched by the harbinger. The Harbinger. I have heard of this Harbinger before. My research mentions it or him as Kronos, having the absolute power over time. The ritual of kindred sacrifice is said to grant the ability to spawn Kronos into our reality. I wonder if anyone was able to do it. My studies also point 
to it being a thing of ancient knowledge and power, suddenly able to travel through space and time, meaning our dimension could intermingle with others. I need to take a break from all this. My head is really not well right now. Okay. What we got in this room? We got the book. Oh, it's probably a safe place, right? No, I don't want to save it yet. Or maybe I should. I feel like I should. Uh, identified again. Let's identify it. Eldritch book? Dusty some... Dusty tome with strange writings. Who knows what lurks within its pages? Use. A uh, major purging powder recipe has been added to something something. What is it added to? Purging powder recipe. I don't know what just happened, let's see. So this is where all I've been, right? Okay, I'm thankful for this map. If without this map, I'd be, I'd be screwed. Okay. Check out the skeleton head. You received a wooden handle. Casket key. That's where I came from. Fireplace. There seems to be a loose piece in an incomplete crest above the fireplace. Should I take it off? Okay. You received crest piece. Fantastic. Anything else? What is this puzzle here? Strange. Strange door with a lock. It has number written on it six. Oh, you know what? Um. Okay, skeleton key part with Roman five. I got two of them. We don't have six. Can't really use it like this. I need to find where its item fits first. That's strange. Okay, I don't think I have this yet. Okay, should we save it now? Maybe not yet. Maybe let's look around a little more. I might regret this. I don't know. I looked in there, right? Um, okay, let's check this door out. I think I will need an axe to get through this one. An axe? Still haven't found it. Well, I'm able to push them. Get out of here. This is not working. <laughs> okay. 
I'll come back when I have an axe. What else? Storage room. Okay. Um, yeah, I guess let's go back this way. Where's that hatch? Uh, where else we have not been yet? Looks like I can go through this door here too. And this red door that might... I don't know if red means it's locked or not. And then there's, there's this door up here too. Uh, but I think this one is boarded up. That's why... No, I don't know. Maybe not. Yeah, this is boarded up. Alright. Uh, where am I? I'm right here. Okay, so let's go this way, and then we'll try this door. Come on. Okay, there's stairs too. I don't want to go up the stairs yet until I made sure I got everything on this floor. Now let's try these two doors here. What lies deep within us shall not be dragged out by the natural instinct of curiosity. I have had my fair share of problems, but sometimes faith in science is all we need. Faith in science, hatch. Oh, so I can, okay, so I can really move from hatch to a hatch. Okay, got it. Okay, well, that's pretty cool. Sure. This will come to good use. What else we got? Okay, we got a workbench here. There's a useful crafting kick I should take with me. Interesting. Crafting. In order to do crafting, you need to have recipes for the different things you want to craft, which I remember picking up a recipe. To be able to craft a recipe, you will need a ma the materials that Adam needs. Materials can be found everywhere in the house. I'm assuming like leather and stuff. Items that can be crafted range from modification kits to lantern oils and other useful things. Cool. Okay, again, the sanity point. Oh, that's fantastic. Uh, Theodore Westmark, that's me. My interest in the occult has never been a tidy one. I try, I really do, but the search for enlightenment is a messy and devour. Identify it. That's it. Okay, let's identify it. What is this? Oh, it's a crafting kit. Okay. Mortar. Identify this spell. Okay. Dusty Tome with Strange Writings. Who knows? Okay. Another spell book. It's got clue in it. So I guess I'll just use it and see what, see what it says this time. Skeleton Key Handle Recipe has been unlocked for crafting. Aha. So I need to read those. What else is here? Okay, how do I craft stuff now? Is it a crafting menu? Crafting kit. Use. Oh, okay, very cool. Crafting kit, okay. Sanity recipes, skeleton key handle recipe. This is four bricks of gold or something. You don't have all the ingredients. Whatever. I wish you told me what the ingredients are. Okay, that's okay. Okay, 
Okay, so are we done here now? I think we might be. Okay, where else? Okay, so the door right here, there's another door. The lock seems broken. Okay, the lock seems broken, that's good. Can't get through here. Okay, lock is, it's locked and it's broken. I got it. Okay, um... All the way straight. Oh, Jesus Christ! <laughs> See that? Somebody trying to get me. Okay, let's go up. Oh. The door to the inner garden is locked for some reasons. Okay, where else? Where else? Um, let's try. Okay, so we got this door right here. And then we got this door right here I haven't been to yet. Like there's a sun symbol H to the doorknob. Does that mean I can sun symbol? Um I don't know, I don't think I can open this yet. Casket key. So the red means locked for sure now, I know that for a fact. And, well, <laughs> those are red and I got through. Ah, no way, it's locked behind me, that's right. Okay, let's go check out the last door that I can on this level. Major Persian power powder. Another door. Okay. What kind of key was it? Receptacle key. W chat crest piece. Sounds like we got lots of puzzles to solve. Well, this thing on top, now we can get to it. Okay. So it look, looks like we got two doors here, right? Where am I? I thought I was up here somewhere. I still don't see myself. Is this me? Oh yeah, okay, This this is me. So let's try this door. Mm, that smell. Nothing you would want to set your teeth in, that's for certain. A kitchen for another purpose than to please the senses. Though this smell I will never forget. Okay, I think this is a good room. Is that a box of matches? Play a match. Look like a box. This looks odd. A pot bubbling with excitement, but the smell is very unpleasant. Gonna do some witchcraft. Meat. Oh. Uh, someone is preparing food here. The meat looks strange and smells bad. Scroll. 
Don't read. Okay, materials of the alchemical bonds. Azoth. It's is a rare and sought after substance only available at certain spots. You cannot touch it by hand and is highly toxic. Digesting it can be lethal in certain doses. Doesn't sound like I want to craft that one. Sunstone. This element has many properties and can be used in alchemical combinations as well as brewing portions. Sulfur is a good base element to combine with an alchemy. 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 <laughs> Uh, usually not good by itself, but works great as a catalyst. Combining sulfur powder with sunstone powder can make a good curse banishment if consumed. How do I go down? Ammonia. It won't let me scroll down for some reason. Together with clay and a couple of drops of azoth make a great and long-lasting lamp oil. Great. Okay. Okay, so it looks like there's one door right here, and that's the last one. Oh, wait. What about this one? Did I try this one already? I had to, right? Interesting. Okay, what is this? Oh, that's the... Okay. Ooh, Elizabeth Diary Entry 4, 10th of June 1891. The Lubumos orb is growing, and I feel less and less like a lady and more like a helpless seal. Theodore is off on expedition and assignments from his work, but he said as soon as he leaves the house, he feels ill. I imagine he tries to be romantic and wants to tell me how he misses me. I'm not sure that's the case, lady. Me, on the other hand, I can barely move, so the maids help out around the house. Ever since Benjamin died, I have felt an odd sensation around the house, as if I'm watched. Might just be the baby feeding me frights. The baby. Can I... What? Okay. In a minute, in a minute. for a minute. <laughs> Nobody's there now. Your inventory is full. Try again when you have space. What? Oh, I got five of those mortars. Oh, okay. I don't have a big one like that. There's a potion here. Okay. So we have plenty of mortars anyway. But I know we're going to find one. Another place I can fast move. Everywhere. This looks odd. to pay for passage of the ancient ancients that's weird there seems to be missing something about the fireplace that's weird uh, I don't have anything like that right right now <clears throat> wait a second I can combine this item with something okay not that let me handle no. I don't know. I don't have anything yet right now. Okay. Uh, I remember this. 
is one of the worst things I wish I never had to encounter. Letter from Elizabeth. My dear love, Theo, I cannot bear the guilt of having you taken care of my soul. Theodore, I think that's me. I lay in bed all day, every day, seeing you in pain while aiding me. I have barely strength to write this letter and wanted to tell you how grateful I am for your grace and care. The pain I bear over what I have done to Jill is impossible to live with as a ma mother. A favor is needed here since I know I cannot do this myself, but you will have to end my life at some point. This sickness won't end and will only get worse and I know you want to find a cure, but I dread that I am far gone at this stage. With deepest regret, Elizabeth. So, we thought we should I just save that somehow? the key part. That's just part of the key. Clock for rewinding, rewinding the clock. Okay. Let's try this one. Ah! I received a sun key. Get this door already checked it. I don't remember. I think this is locked. This is door to like gardens or something. All right. Let's uh, head this way and then back here and maybe save my game. Yeah, that's a, is that the, yeah, that's a room I haven't been yet. I'm glad I went here, but Jesus. Aye, would there be a need for something in me stuck? Uh, oh, I think he's a buddy of mine. <laughs> one of the humans who rather speak than do. I am a big bane of action. <laughs> Fancy seeing you here. Okay. Storage. Oh, I can store items here. Okay. What do you want to leave? Maybe some potions or something? That way you're not going to use right now? I got six matches, that's good. Uh, or ingredients. Let's do that. It's the little ingredients. This is ingredient two. What? Okay. <laughs> 
<laughs> Happy to help. What, he hit you, take it? <laughs> no, he didn't take it. Yeah. Uh, save your current progress, okay. I'll save here then. After I search this place. Another point where you can transfer. Good. Felix, that's his name. Anything else in this room? There's a book right here. Oh, it's this guy. That's to save my progress. Okay, so I think this is it. And I think we want to be done with this floor. Wait, storage cabinet. Greetings. Hello again. Um, let's drop. Did we pick up the other ingredient? Yeah, we did. As a flask. Let's leave that. Time is money, friend. Okay, let's pick up the last one here. Sure, have been yelled. Oh, I'm just gonna save my game. It's gonna cost me one sanity point. All right. Sure. Why well, it cost me two? I was at six. Now I got four. Not very fair. All right, I'm gonna call this part one, guys. Uh, this game is pretty interesting. I mean, I do like it. Um, probably, I'm, hopefully this is a long game and I like playing it. Um, looks like I've got some thinking to do, some puzzles to solve, so, so far so good. See you next time.